Let's go under the radar. Free agent moves yesterday, including Al Horford to the Sixers. We had Terry Rozier to the Hornets, Bogdanovich to the Jazz, Brogdon to the Pacers, Julius Randle to the Knicks, Patrick Beverly staying with the Clippers. Max, mm. your sneaky big move in free agency. <laughs> this is none of these. My sneaky big move is a loss. Meritage goes to Europe? I thought Miritich was ready to be an all-star next year. Like, he has, he's not physically strong in his upper body, but he has quick feet. He can play defense. Like, he's capable of doing it. He's athletic, and he could shoot the lights out. And apparently, he left because he felt like he should be more of a focal point of an offense, which maybe that's true, rather than just a spot-up shooter. I thought Miritich, sneaky, next year, if he stayed on the Bucks would maybe put the Bucks over the top because he wasn't fully integrated as a healthy player into the team. And he's just gone. He's gone from the NBA in his prime. Well, wait a minute. He's home, basically, in Europe. And he's going to be the highest paid player in the history no, of that EuroLeague ball. Those are two pretty damn good yeah. We always assume because it's the NBA and it's the best league in the world that people don't have other interests. Excuse me. You know what? I'm a native New Yorker. We talk about going to Cali, etc. This dude is in America. He might not like it here that much compared to how life is in Europe, especially when you're going to be the highest paid in EuroLeague history. So I look at it from that perspective, and I don't view oh, that. Oh, and to me, he's going to sign with Barcelona? Well, that's, well, right. that's a fantastic that's, 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 city. How about that? And then I take this, to, and then I take this, and that's for you and me. Imagine it's for him since he's familiar yeah. with those surroundings. But the other thing is this. To me, the sneaky move is Brogdon in Indiana mm. because when Oladipo went down, mm -hmm. they were the number three seed in the yeah. East. But they lost okay. Bogdanovich. Wait, I understand that. But you've got Brogdon and Oladipo. You got a hell of a back. backcourt. Come on Steven now. I got some stuff for you. What's up? I, got, I, I, brought, I, I come bearing gifts. Yeah. First of all, because I know it was a tough day for you yesterday, this, this is for Knicks fans. It's a glass half empty, but hold on. I think this is more like it. I'll just leave one little drop. See, there's a little drop on the bottom. It's a glass almost entirely empty. That's for you. And then also, Such I know it, it, the, 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 the big free agent signing, I wanted to be the first one to get you a Julius Randle jer jersey. I hope you rock it. You rock it with pride. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, I thought they were supposed to get KD and Kyrie, the Knicks. I think they would have got KD if he didn't get hurt. It's the Taj Gibson then Kyrie out of the had garden. the control. He's from Jersey. That's where he wanted to go. How's he going to recruit guys? He got Gordon, hurt. Good player. Man. Whatever. <laughs> Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.